Hi, my name is George. In this video, I'll go over how to use the page flip dragonfly to instantly jump from one place in your digital sheet music to another, which is useful when there are repeats in your music. To do this, we'll use the links function that comes with Fourscore, the leading sheet music iPad app. People often ask why they need a quad pedal such as a dragonfly. Beyond using two pedals to turn pages in either direction, the remaining two pedals give you many options. Instantly jumping within a score is one such useful feature. The links function allows you to jump from one measure of the music to another, hence linking two sections of the music together. To set up a link, pull up the four score banner at the top of the screen. Tap the middle of the screen to toggle the banner in case you don't already see it. Now, press the toolbar icon located in the top right corner, and then press links. You should see two copies of your music side by side. Swipe or use the seek bar to flip through the pages of either copy. Press on the left copy at the location from where you must jump. A blue circle will appear designating the location in the music where the link begins. This is the source of the link. You must then flip through the pages on the right copy and press at the location where you must jump to, and an orange circle will appear. This is the destination of the link. Then press save. Notice that if we tap the blue circle, the app takes us back to the destination of the link. This is a convenient function, however in order to do this hands-free, we must assign this function to the pedal instead. To set up one of the upper pedals to activate a link, connect your pedal to your device and ensure that the middle mode is activated on the pedal. Under this mode, the four pedals will emit up, down, and left and right arrows, which we will map to the app in a moment. Next, in the Fourscore app, press the toolbar icon located in the top right corner, and then press Settings, which is located on the bottom of the drop-down menu. Then, press Page Turners and Shortcuts. This shows you a list of all the Fourscore functions that can be mapped to the pedal. Scroll down to the bottom of the list to the Links and Buttons section, and press the Activate Control button. You should see the button highlighted in gray and three small blue dots will appear on the right side of the button. Those dots indicate that the app is waiting for the pedal to tell it which key it should associate with the function. To do so, press any one of the pedals on the Dragonfly, although we recommend using the top right pedal for this purpose. When you press the pedal, you will see the key associated with that pedal appear on the right side, replacing the blue dots. Now that key is associated with activating links in your music. Please remember that you must remain in the middle mode on the Dragonfly in order for the designated pedal to activate links. If you wish to use a designated pedal for a different function instead, you must delete any current use of the key associated with that pedal. In this example, we will X out of the Notes function. Notice that the left arrow in the Notes button disappears. We can now assign that key to any other function by tapping on that function and pressing the desired pedal. Now we have the upper right pedal associated with Activate Links and the upper left pedal associated with the Tools function. The bottom left and right pedals remain in use for page turning. Notice how the pedals perform our desired operations. I hope you now understand how to jump through pages of sheet music by using the link function in Fourscore. It's extremely useful for handling repeats without having to activate multiple page turns manually. I hope you also appreciate the versatility of the Dragonfly quad pedal and how it allows you to map up to four app functions in a compact footprint. You'll be amazed by the convenience and flexibility of the Dragonfly pedal. Please visit pageflip.com for more information.